Bats were hoping for plenty of running lanes on the field today. It's McFadden Cowboys going up against Ivory's Jets. So now let's go to Arlington, Texas, where Jim and Phil have the call. Jets, Cowboys coming up on EA Sports as we come to you from Arlington, Texas for today's game. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims, and we are live here for this primetime matchup. There's all kinds of energy and excitement in the air. These teams get really fired up taking center stage on a night like this. Well, you said it right. Taking center stage. Today's professional athlete, we know it. We talk to all these players all the time. They love it when they're on stage, and everybody is looking at them. Well, let me tell you this. We are looking tonight. This should be fun to watch. The Cowboys are back deep waiting to return the kick. And Randy Bullock looks ready to get this one underway. And with that kick, we're underway. is there that time for the tackle and a run back of about 18. Once a draft pick in Major League Baseball and a long time back up to Tom Brady, here is quarterback Matt Castle. He's strong, he's tough, he has a good throwing arm, he's a leader on the football team. What is there not to like about Matt Castle? McFadden lines up in the backfield. McFadden looking for a lane. That's a gain of six. Holding offense. The defense accepts the penalty. First down. is lined up two tight ends set. Here's the handoff to Darren McFadden. Well, when you get the offense backed up like this, you got to put the pressure on your defense and go out there. We need a three and out so we can get the football back and get good field position. That's second down coming up. with the long throw. As we check now, this offensive unit getting it done for over a decade. Certainly a future Hall of Famer is tight end Jason Witten. I agree, Jim. I think he is a Hall of Fame tight end. And all you do when you see Jason Witten playing football, there's always somebody throw, throw, chasing throw, 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 him because he's figured out a way to get open three, and get it done. Two, four, Castle standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Grabs it with one hand. Brian, such a great athlete. And of course, you got to be a great athlete to be able to make a catch like that. the line and it's first down after the long game let's see what they do here McFadden's going to take the handoff now and Rivas is all over the ball carrier got to give the defense some credit on first down there's so many things the offense can do they were ready for that play and they stopped it second down coming up Look what the defensive line is doing. They're all pinching down inside. They're expecting a run. Huh. 
wants to go deep. And it's incomplete. <laughs> Things have come full circle, Phil, for Darrell Rivas, now back with the Jets after winning a Super Bowl in 2014 with the Patriots. Yeah, it used to be Rex Ryan and his blitzy man-to-man -man defense. Now it's going to be Todd Bowles, the new head coach, and his blitzy man-to-man -man defense. So they needed Darrell Rivas. On the way, third down. Castle's got it in the gun. And it's picked off by Cromarty. He's into the open. He's going to take it home for the touchdown. What a catch, what an interception, and not only that, take it all the way back for a touchdown. You talk about deflating for an offense. Oh, shoot, that, that gets close to making them quit. The Jets now getting set for the extra point. He made it. The Cowboys are ready to run back this kick. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Cowboys bring their offense back onto the field here, trying to avoid a repeat of the mistake on their last drive, which was, of course, an interception. Yeah, you're looking for a way to get that momentum back. And how do you do that with a good play call on first down? Catch the defense off guard, get some momentum on the offense. Get Dean Milliner is there and picks it off. Midway through the first, and this offense now has a chance to build on that lead. The bar rhythms are there for this football team. They woke up, the moon was in the right place. It was all good, Jim, and we've seen it here. Both sides of the ball playing very well. Hey, the offense has a chance to do something with this drive. First down at the 37. Up the gut here. And Ivory's tackled down at the 32. Always good to have these types of runs. Hey, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Second down and five. And Ivory's taking the handoff. Good for only a yard or two. Third down on the way. This Patrick's now going to leave the pocket and tuck it under. Well, the defense was playing pass all the way that time, even though it was third and short. The quarterback moved up in the pocket, took off, but he just doesn't have the foot speed to even get a get a first down on third and short. No good, no good. Interesting little chess match game here as they miss the long field goal and set up the opponents now with an excellent starting point. Anytime you talk about a long field goal, it's 50-50 it's at best. That time, the mechanics of the situation were not perfect. Doesn't look like a good hole, and that's why they missed. The Cowboys' last possession ended painfully with a pick. And I wonder how they're going to handle the football this time around, Phil. Well, listen, I think they'll handle it a little differently, no doubt. I thought it was a bad call on the interception. It just put the quarterback and the offense in such a bad situation, and they were not able to overcome that. The Jets go with the dime formation here on defense. First and ten. There's a flag out. And they bring him down at the 33-yard line. 
holding defense. On that first down. The Jets' defense now is going to go nickel. First down at the 48. And they are in on Nick Matt. But not until it was a gain of five on the play. Nothing like a running back who fights for every extra yard. When you get that extra yard or two, what it does, it just creates better situations for your offense. And it's now second down and five after running it on first down. Witten's shifted out wide to the left as a receiver. Hassel's back in shotgun formation. The hit knocks the ball out incomplete. Well, that was some defensive effort that time to knock the ball away and deny the reception. Yeah, beautiful job. A good defense called by the defensive coordinator. But the defender timed it perfectly. And that's what it's all about in the NFL. you got to time up these throws and catches and hits exactly and the defender did it that time the quarterback's picked up on something he's changing the play here that's dropped by Bryant who couldn't bring it in this defense off to a terrific start well they call third down the money down because you try to keep drives going and right now the defense has all the money because they're the ones getting it done be a touchback and the ball will be placed at the 20. First down at the 20. Here's the handoff out of the strong eye. Ivory's trying to be patient but there is nowhere to run that time and he only gets a short game. That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. Fitzpatrick set in the pistol. Crawford gets to the quarterback. You're talking about a bonus. When you get a defensive tackle that can get in the backfield and sack the quarterback, that is something special. Great job that time by the big D tackle. And they overcome the sack. Third down on the way. The Cowboys. Defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Fitzpatrick's going to take it from the gun. He pulls it down somehow. That's his first reception today. The Jets put themselves in a terrible situation. Third and long, but you know what? They got a lot of talent on the offensive side, and that was an awesome job of picking up that first down. Here's the first snap after the big play. And Ivory's got it on the handoff. 